I love them, okay? These are... I actually forgot how much I love these pants. There we go, now I can see full on from here. Brilliant, okay, we're there, we're doing it. Work it, guys. Welcome back to my channel so I'm sorry about the outfit I don't think I'm gonna be keeping this basically what I've done is put on this rack like my favorite outfits from last year slash things I bought for this year sorry I cannot talk I'm so excited but I'm also absolutely sweating the sun is belting in it's like 30 degrees 30 odd degrees probably and I've got a ton of outfits to try on uh, if you can see my bra through this it's not actually a bra it is my bikini so don't worry if I flash it, it's my bikini. Um, but yeah, that's basically what we're going to do is just look through my wardrobe because I need to do a massive clear out. I'm surrounded by clothes, but these are the bits that, you know, I want to show you guys because they're absolute bangers and I'm going to try and link as many of them as I can down below. But also, obviously, clear out because I'm up to here reading really also. Starting off, this that I'm wearing, I'm not sure I'm going to be keeping. I folded the shorts up because they're kind of like an... I feel like it's a bit of an awkward length. But they're kind of long, aren't they? Do you know what I mean? They're on. Oh my god, these are cute, okay? There we go, now I can see full on from here. Brilliant, okay, we're there, we're doing it. Work it, guys. Okay, so these are the pants. I mean, apart from the little bit of a camel that it gives me occasionally, these are the best fit guys ever what size are these an extra small or a small extra small and they cost me 3.99 at pull and bear i bought these just like a few days before coronavirus i mean and if i'd have remembered i'd have had them i would not have taken these off the whole coronavirus they are so comfy also please ignore my ankles they're kind of swollen <laughs> Um, but yes, I mean, these are the next thing. Don't know if you can see, they're, they're like cool lot style. I mean, I'm pretty sure you can see quite far down now that I've zoomed out, but um, they're kind of cool lot um, and kind of mid. To say I'm tall, they're on an amazing point on my leg. Like, I really love these. And I'm definitely going to be wearing them because they're super thin. And as you can tell, like, I'm white, I'm very pale, so. I'm not going out in shorts anytime soon. I love them, okay? These are... Yeah, this is the only trouble we're having. <laughs> I cannot get them down again. But, I mean, we're going to work on it, okay? I'm going to work on this part. Could I put an elastic in them or something? Because, I mean, I cannot get them down. Wow, okay. Okay. <laughs> Okay, I'm not keen on the back of them. Okay, so these are another pair that I bought at the same time as the others. I mean, I mean, I mean, I really like them, but I have one down thing, but I mean, it's a problem of my own. So basically I have this problem and I'm taking treatment for it, but my legs are really swollen at the moment. And these are hella tight <laughs> um, because they've got this elastic um, but may I say I, I cannot wear these in the summer it's so hot right now I cannot wear these these are uh, uh, for a different time but hon I love these these are so nice may I just say also with the zippers the big pockets everything I love these I love these especially like if I go back to work or whatever yes but just, as I say, it's 30 degrees. It's not for today, these aren't. Um, oops, the label's just come off in my hand. These were 5 99 down from 22 99 from Pull and Bear. And again, I haven't even worn them, so... Such a bargain. Such a bargain. So ready to take these off. Okay, so again, here we've got some cargo pants. These, again, Pull and Bear. I mean, Pull and Bear are not just my go-to. Like, they have some gems. I mean, I wouldn't wear it with this top necessarily. Mm, would I? I'd definitely wear it with a belt. Hang on. This is my go-to belt from Primark. Like, I just wear this with everything. Uh, but I would probably not wear these pants with this top. I'd wear it more with, like, 
a rusty orange top, which I've actually got one there, um, tucked in or something like that. I actually forgot how much I love these pants. But this is more the t-shirt I'd wear it with, either like in a little knot or tucked in just... I'd probably go for the tucked in actually, like just for more cash comfy, but this is what this is the top that I'd always used to wear them with. And I mean that's a vibe. Also scrunchie <laughs> to match. I'm obsessed with this, like these pants, they're coming back out. These aren't going anywhere. Also they make the booty pop. I'm all about these pants. I'm all about them. I love, love, love these pants. So this isn't the top that I'd wear, but I just thought it was fun to put it in because this top was actually the first top that I wore on my channel. Um, I wore this in my first ever YouTube video, which was actually a clothing haul. It's actually probably the first thing I bought from Home Bear 2. I mean, who knows, why did that do that? That's so weird. Okay, so this is the only top I've found that kind of goes with this pa these pants and it even doesn't, and it just doesn't go with them. I don't like how it looks. I love the pants, I just don't know what I can wear with them. What could I wear with them? So basically they're like cigarette pants, I'd say cigarette trousers. Um, and they've got this really nice belt on. Um, I'm pretty sure that if you actually wore these right though, you could pair them with like, like I said, a really fancy bralette or something like that and some heels. And these are so dressy, like so dressy, but you can also casual them down. I just cannot find a top that I'd wear with them to show you. Maybe this top. No. What top do you think I could wear with them? If you know, please comment down below some ideas or even send me some links because... Mm -mm. These are the comfiest pants ever. They're so comfy. Um, they have this like rope tie too, which I really like. Comfy as the comfiest things ever. Like, I don't think you could find some pants comfier than these that are so nice like I really like these I think they're pretty hit and miss like you either love them or hate them but I mean they're so nice I think it, again you can really dress them up or dress them down like if you wore these with like a navy plain top or then like a crochet bra like I think you could like do so much with them I really love them and as you can tell they're like super baggy comfy they're not tight anywhere, they've got massive pockets, like massive pockets. Um, and I, I think they're flattering, like I think they're so flattering. I think anyone could get away with them, like fair enough, yeah, a shorter person. They might be like ankle grazes on them, I don't know how that would look, but I'm pretty sure any size could get away with these pants and any body shape, like I think they're so flattering because I mean you can just like play with the top play with like what you're wearing with but with some sandals trainers i mean you can do wonders with these pants i love them again these are pull and bear i bought them last year but i'm pretty sure they'll have the same or something similar so i shall link them down below they're so nice i really like them okay so these shorts i wore them with this top last year to work sorry i've got my knickers up my bum um i wore these shorts to work last year with this t-shirt i'm pretty sure i did and I mean they're a bit on the short side now that I'm looking at them from a different angle. You can almost see like your bum cheek but they're so like I really like them. They're kind of like a love-hate thing though because I'm not quite sure. They're not that flattering are they? But I love like the frill and the loose and how comfy they are but don't know what you think about them let me know. You can either wear them with like this top but then they're even cuter with this. Wait let me pop it on. I haven't fastened it but as you can see they look so much like cuter and more put together with this top and um, this top also has a ton of buttons down the back and it's so pretty I'm not sure where I got it from but it was like one euro I'm sure I think it was like a second hand shop um but yeah this is that also my legs are full of scars oh my gosh let me know down below if you like the shorts because it's kind of a love-hate relationship I've got over here I'm not like him on them Mm -mm. I don't know if I should keep them this year or just get rid. Sorry shorts. I don't know. How pretty are these? They're like the nicest pants I've got in my wardrobe, like for sure. They're so flattering. Like look at the fit of these. Like do not tell me that these are not the most perfect fit. Like 
I mean, there's a tiny little crinkle there, but can they get any better? I'm pretty sure they can't. I think these are a 34. I mean, as if I'm going to see that. Oh, yep, I did. They're a 32, which is a size 6. They're beautiful. Like, I've always loved them, but now I've popped them on and I love them again. I wore these to the nursery, like, end of term. And I got so many compliments on them. And they were like, oh my god, I wanted to get hold of them and I couldn't. And I was like, yes. Um, but yeah, I love them. To say they're sold out, I haven't seen, like, anyone wearing them. Um, but as I keep saying, I love them. They're super thin material. They're this really summery orange colour, white polka dot buttons, everything. Like they give me the Emily Cannon feels, like 100%. And I used to wear this with like a wicker basket, this top, you know, just, just cash, you know, really casual but really dressy up. I love it. It also came, I mean, they sold it as a cord, a cord, cord. And it had this um, polka dot, the exact same polka dot with buttons down the middle, I think. Or did it not? I'm not sure if it had buttons down the middle top. But it was just too, you know, bare chested for me. I'm very self conscious of my chest area, my collarbone, everything. So it did not work. But I'm definitely feeling like if I had like a tight white vest thing, like that would look so nice. It's so pretty. I love them. They're so pretty, I absolutely love them and they fit like a glove, like so nice. I'm obsessed. I really hope that I can find them and link them down below for you because, wow. Okay, whilst I've still got my, this top on, I'm just going to show you these shorts. Oh my god, they fit even better this year round. These are my mum jean shorts from Pull and Bear. I mean, how good of a fit are they? They're like cropped. But then they do not show your bum cheeks, which is one of my favourite things about shorts. I don't want them to show my bum cheeks. Like, there was a time that you could not find any jeans with any length to them. I love the fit of them. I love the colour. I love everything. Like, I just feel like Pull and Bear do the best jeans. Um, so, yeah, I own so many of their mum jeans. Well, last year I decided to buy these, which are the shorts. They also have them again this year, so I will link them down below. I think they're like 25 euros, but they're so worth it. Um, so yeah, these are them and I just really love them. They're just really like the perfect everyday jean, denim short. Love them. Okay, so next up I have this dress. One second, one more button to go, which I love. Also, sorry about my legs throughout this video. I hate my legs. <laughs> um, but this dress is so pretty. Like, don't get me wrong, I think it's so adorable. But the material is so sweaty and it's like fleecy type material. It's so warm and so thick. Um, I bought this at Primark last year. It's 14 euros and it was so worth it. But as I keep saying, it's just so sweaty is this dress. But I love it. It's such a shame. I basically, I, bleh, I basically really, really wanted a polo dress. But I didn't expect it to have buttons up it or be stripe it. And it's just like, I've got a photo of myself on my first day of little school. And it's just this. But I love the length of it. I love everything about it. Just the material is the only damn thing. But nevertheless, I love it. And I still wear it because Sharpe Evans once said you have to suffer to look good. Something like that. <laughs> Don't even know. So that ruined the moment. But anyway, um, this is it. And I really, really like it. Sorry, I can't tie it. But I've just, I've had this romper for so long. But again, it's the thinnest best material i've worn it like mad also look at the back of it i mean please excuse it. i've got my bikini on and i haven't fastened it properly but it's so pretty and what can i say i love it and this is from h&m it's worn so well because i'm pretty sure it's like four year old now uh, so i'm not expecting to link it down below don't worry but i just wanted to say that h&m sell the best rompers play suits whatever you want to call this I think it's so flattering, like I love it, I've worn it like mad as I keep saying, I'm going to try and set some photos of it, I mean, wearing it and you can see how long ago it is, um, but it never goes out of fashion and like I say, it wears perfectly, it's not bobbly anywhere at all and I've worn it like mad, like billio. This skirt is another one that I don't know how to wear, where I'm just going to like pop my shirt up just out of the way, not for it to look like this, but just to show you the skirt because that's the main icon in this outfit. So I saw it in Bershka in the sale, but the zip was popped. This zip here, wherever it is, it's an invisible slit. 
and it was popped and I was like I'm not gonna buy a broken skirt like what's the point but then I was obsessed with it I kept like do you know when you go home but you're like thinking about this skirt so I went back again and it wasn't there but then I went again and it was there and it was still the broken one there was no other sizes there was none available on the internet because it was the sale so I decided to buy it but then I've got like this I just don't know does it just not fit my figure properly or what like Look at that, like it's so, like fair enough, it fits my bum perfectly because I almost pop it every time. <laughs> um, basically I fixed it when I bought it and then I've almost popped it again every time I put it on. But it's kind of like big here but it can't be any smaller because if it is it wouldn't get over my bum if that makes any sense. So I cannot take it in even though why would you want to because it's the tiniest gap. But what top can I wear this with? Again, I just don't know because like this top say it just don't work i'm not keen on that i don't like how it looks but like what top could i wear with it please let me know because i've just got no clue whatsoever i just think that just does not look right no it don't look right does it anyway this is the last outfit um psst, mm, i'm not sure how i feel about it i love the jumpsuit in itself like look how flattering it is with the cross back but i know you're supposed to wear it without a t-shirt under but it just looks like crap on me it clashes with my skin tone <laughs> that's one of the things i mean you can see the t-shirt which you're not supposed to um whatever we'll sort it when we need to um yeah it clashes with my skin color but apart from that like i've just got like such a bony neck i hate it so i mean we need to hide that <laughs> um but I don't know how I feel about it. It's super comfy, give me that. The zip is again seamless, like so hidden, well hidden. Again, fits amazingly for like a culotte jumpsuit. Like it's so flattering here, like it doesn't all crumple or make you look fat or anything like that. Again, the fit here is also really good because I haven't fastened it properly. <laughs> um, and yeah, it's culotte style very wide leg and a decent length um but i just don't like it for myself i don't think just don't really hmm anyway that's it we've tried everything on so i really hope you did enjoy this video if you did please smash the thumbs up i'm going to go and do something about my fingers now and about my feet because i think i'm gonna to have to go to the doctors so i mean at least if my feet are pretty <laughs> Um, they will not look as bad when they're red and swollen. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you do, please smash the thumbs up. Subscribe down below if you haven't already. Hit the notification bell. Don't know why I've decided to now say that in my videos. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for all the support these past few days. And I'll see you guys soon with a new video. So until then, bye bye.